We're staying on top of breaking news. Authorities say a Multnomah County Sheriff's deputy was involved in a shooting in the Lloyd District in Northeast Portland. We want to take you live where the Portland police are briefing us on that situation. At this point in time, we have three different scenes that we are working on. Um, what I can tell you is that we have one person that is in the hospital um, from gunshot wound. Um, that person is receiving treatment at this time. And unfortunately, due to the fact that this is an on, open, ongoing investigation, we have limited details that we have um, at this moment in time. We hope to have more details, hopefully tomorrow morning, that we can share with you in regards to things that occurred here today. We're not going to be taking any questions. I apologize in advance for that, just simply because we have three separate scenes that we're in the process of working through and uh, multiple, multiple agencies assisting with the investigation. Can you say whether this person was shot at Grand and Holiday or Grand and Widler, where they were, where they were shot specifically? So, uh, like I said, unfortunately at this point in time, we're, we're not going to be answering any of the questions. What's the status of the person in the hospital? They're receiving treatment. Is it serious, critical? I don't have those details that I can release at this time. Where was the first scene at? Um, we are working on that investigation piece where we have three scenes. Uh, the investigators are putting all that information together. I walked up late. Did you mention if anybody was in custody? So there are going to be uh, an incident. Uh, sorry. Um, that is all going to be part of the investigation and the outcome um, in the next day or two where we'll be able to release that information. So you're not confirming whether somebody's in custody, but you say you'll confirm that tomorrow? Tomorrow. Is it just the one deputy involved? Um, I don't have all those details at this time. What time did everything really start happening? Lieutenant, do you know the exact times of this? I, I believe the initial call um, started at around what was the initial call? You know, I, like I said, a lot of that is still being looked into. We tried to get as much information as possible to be able to release to you guys at this point in time. But unfortunately, we're not given a whole lot of information to be able to release at this time. So like I said, our goal is hopefully by tomorrow morning, we'll have a lot more information available to you um, so that the public can know what, what occurred. What other, what other agencies are helping you guys in this Right now, Portland Police Bureau is taking up the lead in the investigation, and then we have the Multnomah County Sheriff's Office here. And Troutdale was here too? So we contract with the city of Troutdale, so those fall under the Sheriff's Office. Do we know if the person shot was a man or a woman? So those details have not yet been released as well. What about the area here? What do you expect? Several more hours? We're probably looking at a few more hours um, that this area will be shut down. Um, we apologize for that, but we want to ensure the fact that a thorough investigation is done um, to ensure, um, you know, everything is processed accordingly. What's the perimeter? So the, the perimeter we do not have at this point. Um, the perimeter was initially set because we were still looking for folks that might be outstanding. There is nobody left outstanding at this point. How about street closures now? I'm sorry. Where, where uh, are the street closures? So we're going to have no more questions at this time. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thanks, guys.